Hello everyone, in today's tutorial I am going to show you how you can make this telephone on Blender app. So to make this telephone, let's open the Blender app. Go to add menu, add a plane, select this mesh, go to edit mode, then press E and extrude. Again press E and extrude, press S and scale down, press G and then press X and move it along the X axis. Again press S then X and scale down along X axis. G X and move it along X axis. S, Y and scale down along Y axis, go to object mode, then go to modify setting and I will add a bevel modifier. Increase the segments to 2, add another modifier which is subdivision surface modifier. Increase level viewpoint to 2 and shade it smooth. Apply our modifier settings. Again add a plane surface and move it along Z axis, S, X and scale down along X axis. S, Y and scale down along Y axis. Select the move tab and move it. After this select this plane, go to object and then apply all transforms. And then go to modifier setting and I will add a mirror modifier. Make a mirror modifier along Y axis. Then go to edit mode. Then press ctrl R to add a loop cut. Select this loop cut, place it right here. Add another loop cut and place it here then select this face selector and select these two faces press e and extrude go to object mode add a subdivision modifier increase level viewpoint and shade it smooth apply all modifier settings go to edit mode press s and z and scale up along the z-axis then press g and z and move it along the z-axis again go to object mode add a circle Move it along Y axis, press 7 to see top view, press S and scale down. Then go to edit mode, press F to add a face, then press E and extrude. Then press S and scale up, then press E and extrude. Again press E and extrude it. Once again press E and extrude and then scale down. After this select the face selector and select these four faces. Then press E and extrude. Go to object mode, select this surface and go to object and apply all transforms. Then go to modifier setting and I will add a mirror modifier and make a mirror along y axis. Again go to edit mode, select these four faces, press E and extrude them. Press S and then press Y and scale down along y axis. Select this bottom face, press S and scale down. Then press I and insert. Then press G and Z and move it along Z axis like this. Go to object mode and add a subdivision modifier. Increase level viewpoint and shade it smooth. Go to edit mode. Then press A to select all. Then press G and Y and move it along the Y axis and scale down. Again press G and Y and move it along Y axis. After this select these four faces. Press A and extrude. Then select bottom these four faces and move them along the z-axis. Then go to object mode and place it to a proper location. After this I am going to make dialing pad for this. Go to add menu and add a circle. Move the circle like this. Then go to edit mode and press F to add a face. Press S and scale down it. Press E and extrude it. Then go to object mode and add a bevel modifier. Increase the segments, shade it smooth, go to add menu and add a cylinder. Press 7 to see the top view and move the cylinder on the circular surface, press S and scale down. Then press shift D to duplicate and move the duplicated cylinder like this. Shift D to duplicate and move it. In this way I will keep on duplicating it and I will keep on placing it to a proper location to make a dialing pad for the telephone. After placing all these cylinders next I am going to add a modifier to all these cylinders. For this select one cylinder then go to object and apply all transform. Select this circular surface go to modifier setting and add a boolean modifier. Select this object and, and then select this object. Apply the modifier setting. Select this cylinder and move it. You can see hole is properly created for the dialing pad. In this way I will apply 
boolean modifier to all the cylinders now delete this cylinder select this cylinder go to object and apply your transform then select this circular surface go to modifier and apply a boolean modifier select this object and apply move this cylinder and delete it After making this dialing pad, select this dialing pad and shade it smooth and then place it to a proper location. Select the rotate tab and rotate. So dialing pad is properly adjusted on its position. Next I'm going to apply material to this. For this go to material tab add a new material. In the metallic add one give it black color add another material give it gray color and in the metallic again add one then select this surface add a new material and apply the first material select this dialing pad add a new material then select the gray material then select this surface add a new material and again select the gray material then select this telephone add a new material Again, select the first material. So, 1945 telephone is ready. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the video, show your reaction in the comment section. And if you want our services, connect us on the LinkedIn. See you in the next video. Bye bye.